Now that cold front slid through today, really dropped those temperatures, barely getting into the 70s for most of us, and the dew points significantly lower, really refreshing to end the weekend, especially after a slightly humid Saturday. But look at where temperatures are headed tonight. Again, this is forecast to be the coldest overnight low to kick off the month of July since 2001, and a lot of us are going to get close to that record. Grand Rapids will be about three degrees off the record overnight low, and if the winds quiet down here quick enough the rest of this evening and go completely calm, well, we could get a little bit closer to it. Winds right now are out of the north, anywhere from five to seven miles per hour. It is keeping temperatures in the upper 50s for most, but look at Cadillac already at 46 degrees. There's going to be some upper 30s there in those inland counties in northern lower Michigan. Good news is we are under a lot of sunshine into Monday, so clear skies tonight, sunshine Monday, but the next system is already starting to set up out west from the Colorado Rockies up into Montana. Those showers and thunderstorms are going to lead into a more organized system by the time we get into the middle of the work week, but we'll start it out on the right foot. Beautiful highs in the mid to upper 70s, 77, 78, and again, full sunshine. It'll be a nice day with light winds too. Tuesday, 80s return, but rain chances increase, especially in the afternoon hours and for our northern communities. Wednesday morning, as the cold front slides through with that system, it'll bring us a morning storm chance, but we're not looking at significant rainfall totals until our rain chance moves in on Friday. So Tuesday, focused in the afternoon, and I would even discuss more northern communities, uh, especially Muskegon, Oceana County. Wednesday, it's focused in the morning hours. Thursday, mainly in our southern communities as that cold front suppresses, and then it builds back in, and Friday looks like, again, the rainiest day of the forecast. So here's future track and look at just how dry and quiet we are until we get to Monday evening. And even as this cloud deck approaches, it's only going to be high clouds. So Monday, full sunshine until the evening, high clouds until Tuesday morning, and then the cloud deck will start to thicken up. And there's that rain chances starting to move in. This is not expected to bring us any severe weather. And for the start, it looks like just a few showers, I think will lead into some thunderstorm chances Tuesday late evening and then into Wednesday morning as well. But again, we're starting it out on the right foot. Lake Michigan Beach for Forecast tomorrow, low wave heights, light winds, water temps in the upper 60s, a great opportunity to get out to the lake and enjoy it. Here's the high temperatures across the region, upper 70s here today, uh, tomorrow, 78 in Allegan, 78 in Holland, 77 most areas inland. We're setting up nicely and the temperature outlook kicking us off here for the month of July. This is the entire month outlook. We're actually trending into the equal chance or just slightly above average for the month. So it may not be an overly hot one and we're starting it out a little cooler as well. Average high is 83 degrees. So Monday cooler than average, Tuesday cooler, Wednesday we finally warm things up. We hold steady. Fourth of July, again trending drier, 83, partly cloudy skies.